shots. They believe they're coming from within the compound. Gun type appears to be a uh, handgun. Let's check on the uh, looks like a 45 cal. How's it going, everybody? This is Nick the KO Kid Christy with Cobra Source MMA out here in Modesto, California at Paul Mendoza Dynamic MMA. We're going to be speaking with Steve Lar today. He has a fight coming up October 26th for Art of War production at the Chicken Ranch Bingo and Casino. He's fighting on the Art of War show. Yeah, it's, well, we have one. We have one guy, Steve Lara. Um, he's our he's our pro uh, news pro, and um, um, he's fighting Art of War. He's his second fight. He he had he's coming off a really close loss to a really great fighter from Ogilvy Man named Eloy Garza. That was a real tough split decision. And this is his second um, pro fight, and we're really hoping to get his feet underneath him and take um, off. Steve Lara just got done with a good um, pro practice right now. He has a fight coming up October 26th at the Chicken Ranch. Being casino. How you been doing today? Doing good. Just uh, finished a nice, tough workout. Putting in work. Looking good. Looking good for a friend. So, what do you think about your next opponent on um, the Chicken Ranch fight? Um, you know what? I really don't know too much about him. I know. I think he has a wrestling background. He's a uh, 0 2, coming off a, a little layoff. So, I'm pretty sure he's pretty hungry. I'm coming off a, a, my first pro loss, so I need this W. So, I, I'm, I think I'm going to be a little bit more hungry than he is. Yeah, not, not to give up too much, um, so what have you been preparing for? Have you changed anything? Are you going to go out there and do the same thing? Or is there anything that you've seen in his past? I always ask people, but you know, anybody ever changes, you know, they do one thing and next you know they train for something else. So is there any weaknesses that you've seen on this guy? Uh, you know what? I really have. I looked him up a few times. It's been a few months, but uh, I know he's a little scrapper. He likes to brawl, but um, he likes to get real close, and I think he's going to go for the takedown. So we've been practicing a lot of wrestling, uh, defense takedowns, you know. Um, I'm always practicing my stand-up, so just more or less, th my last fight I did nothing but a lot of stand-up. I wanted to go out there and show people that I could stand up and bang. People were talking about, uh, I just like to take people to the ground and bang them out, so I wanted to go sh show everybody I got a little bit of stand-up, you know, so this time, I think I'm gonna go back to my old roots. Uh, if I have to, take them to the ground and finish them like I usually do. But uh, just been uh, a lot of defense on the takedowns. That's about it that I changed. That's for sure. I see your cardio is real good. Do you know anything about his cardio? You know what? Um, I don't know too much about the guy. Um, I know his name's Raul Estrada. Uh, I don't know his card. I don't, how, I don't know how good his cardio is. I mean, I've seen a couple of his fights. It goes all three rounds. He's in there banging nonstop. So I'm pretty sure he's going to be hungry. You know what I mean? Um, I hope he's, his cardio's up to par because I've already been in the gym five weeks straight. So I, this last two weeks, I've been noticing my cardio is finally picking up where it should be. Still got another about three weeks. By then, I'll be ready to bang all three rounds, you know, if I have to. But I'm not looking to go all three rounds. I'm trying to finish this guy. That's always good. How's your weight cut and everything? You um, diet a lot. When do you start your weight cut? You know what? Uh, usually, I walk around a little bit. My last weight cut, I think it was uh, 20 pounds, 25 pounds. This time around, I stayed a little light. I think I'm like 15 pounds off. So I've been uh, already, you know, the I just wait for the last two weeks to start cutting back my uh, calories, smaller portions, and take all, you know, the, the carbs, look, carbs a little bit here and there. But... I don't really start cutting until the last two weeks, but other than that, my weight's, I'm about 12 pounds off, so it's no biggie. 
Sounds good. Do you want to do have any shout outs to any of your sponsors, anything else like that coming out? Yeah, you know what? Big shout out to Cobra Dash Source for coming out here all the time. Turning on tickets, can they hit you up, come down to the gym, how they get tickets for me for your fight? Yeah, you, uh, I got Facebook. You can hit me up on Facebook. If not, we got them right here at the gym, right here. Just come to the gym. We got them in here. Dynamic oh. MMA, yeah. Thank you very much, man. Thanks again for having us out here. I appreciate it, man. This is Nick the KO Kid Christy with Cobra Source MMA. Just wrapping up the last little interview. We're out.